right. Theoretically, this thing is working. I suppose we'll find out soon enough. There we are, there we are. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay. What the heck? You know, I will never understand this ad timer. I swear it started before, and now it's going slower. <laughs> it's like apparently three minutes means something different to Twitch than it does to me. Eh, very strange, very strange. Oh well. Seriously, don't understand the ad timing. Oh well, <laughs> no one should be caught in ads right now, anyway. I think. Maybe. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 
bad 80 songs done let's start going all right let's see how loud is this gonna be for me actually not too bad right now stop that oh heavens stop it i don't want the mixer i just want the regular Okay. Everything seems to be working up. And, uh, there we are. Hmm. Okay. All right, this is where I left off. So last time, after quite a bit of backtracking, I found out that I wanted to be friends with the Beholder and... S oh, heavens. Okay. <laughs> Instead of, uh... killing him. Though I'm a little disappointed. He is a merchant, but he doesn't buy anything stolen, so he's kind of useless. All right, there's not... doesn't appear to be anything down here worth going into. And... Now I'm a little more paranoid for doorways, considering I forgot one and thus nearly missed the plot event of my mage getting killed. I'm sure he'd argue with the cl characterization of as my mage, but he was useful. Ah. A battle site with shit on the ground. Let's see. Eh, do I want a bone? Yeah, we can carry a bone for a bit. Do I want another bone? Not really. Do I want to fight a skeleton chieftain? Oh shit, apparently I do not. What am I holding? Um, it would probably help if I found out. And didn't pause. Alright. Oh, that's why. Okay, it would probably help if I had a sword out. <laughs> I disarmed myself because of a fucking beholder. On the plus side, gotta say, this, uh, this magic sword is quite nice. I'm glad I got it from that, uh, what was it? I stole it as an artifact. It was a good plan. Okay. Hi. There we go. I mean, all the toys that I could have gotten were nice, but I have to say, I think the shield was an excellent choice. I do rather like that we fuck with, uh, what's his name about it? Where did you get that thing? As though I didn't get my own sword from the same place. But, he fucked with us first, so I guess it's only fair. And we're drow. Oh, fuck. Okay, my speaking of fuck. Will strike true. This was not my intention. Fortunately, those things are not that difficult to kill. I think. Yeah, I'm not scared. Okay, we'll keep an eye out for that. Okay. I'll have your life. Yeah. The problem is, right now, I've been playing too much of a different game, unless my I'm doing all the wrong things when it comes to trying to control the game. And then when I go play that game, I'm gonna try to control it like Neverwinter Nights. I only have room in my head for means of playing one game at a time, <laughs> I think. Uh, other people can keep that sort of thing straight, not fucking me. Alright, I know there's a few lootable corpses here. Probably just skeleton knockoffs. Oh, but that's nice. Okay. I was hoping for that. Now, I finally got my 11th level. 11th level. Now, we'll probably do another assassin. Because assassin levels are fun. Let's see. Move silently. Hide. Open lock. No lock can thwart me. Search. Ain't gonna let anything get past my eyes. Tumble, of course. And use magical device. Very boring. Oh, but I get uncanny dodge too. De death attack plus three, or three d six, and darkness, which I already had kind of. But you know, it's nice to have it more than once. There's a little bit of redundancy sometimes, admittedly. Okay. 
that was fun. I got to murder myself some zombies. <sighs> now, if I'm not mistaken, I should check these. Yeah, it seems like they all got skeleton fingers. I ain't gonna bother with those. Well, maybe one. Um, I mean, this does seem like a likely place to find an evil mage, which I think is something I'm looking for. Oh. Oh, there's a morgue. What the hell's a morgue? It seems bigger than the others. Fortunately, eh, he's immune to sneak attacks and critical hits. God damn it, undeads are annoying. Um, and I should probably save my asshole before he dies. Come on, asshole. Let me shove this down your gullet. There. Well, theoretically. Okay, back to killing this. We thing. won't both walk away from this. All right. Oh. Okay, that's not bad. Glad I stuck around for that. I'm thinking though. Oh no, no, no. Really? <laughs> After all that, I just got the inventory bug. Well, that's how it goes sometimes. At least I'm not very far in. And it wasn't a terribly difficult fight. So I guess I'm going to unload that, reload that, and so quick save a few more times as we go. And now I have that fucking song in my head. That's what I get for for humming Tiffany while uh before I start playing. Okay. <laughs> All right, no more of that. <laughs> Okay, up there was useless, so I'm not going to even bother going there. Doesn't seem to be anyone around. I think we're alone now. The beating of my heart is the only sound. I didn't know I knew that many other words. What do you know? Oh, yep. Let's put that thing back on. <laughs> I'm trying to punch a skeleton, and I'm not a monk. Alright. Die, unworthy. Okay. Hi. Hello. Cleave is fun. I don't think I'm strong enough for Cleave with this character, but that's okay. There's plenty of other uh, fun feats I can do. Focus for that matter. I should probably consider doing that actually. I am old enough to actually remember Tiffany. <laughs> Meaning that I remember that song before Umbrella Academy used it. Being old is fun. Oh. Alright, let's kill these assholes. Uh, this is not very complicated. There we go. Yeah, take one. Take one, pass the rest down. So. Oh, hello. Or. <laughs> Some necromancer's been kind of naughty, I think. <laughs> Alright. Hello, Effector! How are you? You missed me, uh, badly singing Tiffany. To myself. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. Well, it's a bit late for you to get home. Working late? Well, you don't. 
have to tell me if you don't want to. Alright, there's someone I gotta kill around here. One sec. Where'd, the, where'd that asshole go? Maybe not. Maybe I already killed him. I feel like there's one around here. I probably need to do something to trigger his appearance. Oh, your sister's concert. Yeah, you. I saw you mention something about that in Emmy's stream. Oh, I think I just hit that button like four times. That's okay. <laughs> Yeah, she's little, isn't she, your sister? Well, good for her. That's a great age to have a, to get to go those concerts. They're all so cute. That is one thing I envy a little bit, is I don't get to go to cute relatives' concerts, because I don't think I have any child relatives at this point in time. Oh, well, maybe like a second cousin, but I don't think that really counts. And by second cousin, I mean like a second cousin's kid, not even an immediate kid. Well, I think my dad's nephew, uh, that cousins on that side of family have kids, probably. Hello! Third grade, that is young. Hi, Toasty, how are you? Alright, let's see. I don't want to get hit by the inventory bug again, so I'm going to save right after I, I level. But I do like leveling. Look at that. Look at these pretty stats. Now, I'm not being at all surprising, given my stat numbers. Ah, I'm going to enjoy going back to Thief when I get when I get a few more skill points per level. <laughs> then maybe I can put try to make up some of my uh, deficiency. Ah, Toasty, you are in it. So, every yep, Effector is everywhere, and Toasty is in your... Into your walls. Good to know. Good to know. All right. Both of you missed me. Uh, missed me singing. I hope. <laughs> Fucking eighties songs. Way, way, way too. They just echo in your brain until you have to try to see what you remember of them. Hmm. I think Toasty and the squirrels are friends. Though really, Toasty. Considering that squirrels eat nuts, you might want to, you might want to wind them out. The same. <laughs> I'm surprised Evie doesn't scare them away. Hi, Emmy. I aren't you playing your game? You should be playing your game. Oh, you raided out. I see. I see. Well, did you have fun? I hope you did. I am busy stabbing uh, undead things with a magic sword. Ah, the baby bunnies. Ah, a shame, a shame. Oh, why are you people not hostile? That makes me nervous. But it's like faction bug or plot. A faction bug, bug or, or faction bug or plot. Um, actually, they seem to be helping me. That's a little weird. Again. Faction bug or plot? Actually, this game's been pretty good about not being buggy, so I'm thinking it might be plot. Ah, I'm almost, I've almost got my armor to level 15, so I can finally get rid of those uh, uh, un ill advised glamour books that I bought. And then I can ignore them for a while, though I kind of want decent. The hoarder's uh, vague justification for shit. <laughs> I don't think you can stop a cat from scratching a wall, Toasty. I'm sorry. I, I think that's just, like, the rule. Oh, I should jot that down. <laughs> okay. Oh, now there's going to be a fight, man. Fight, fight, fight. Alright. More strangely unhostile undead, but they are not talking to me. They're just looking at me. Anything in their description? Mm, just the standard stuff. The bones of the dead, animated by dark magic. Skeletons have no mind of their own. They are but an extension of their master's will. Hmm. 
Well, I mean, Toasty, you could be in her walls, too. I feel like that's a lack of ambition. Unless we're talking about, uh... Oh, shoot. Are you the mage I get to destroy for the Driders? I hope you are. You just seem like you'd be nice and killable and I can take your stuff. So am Hunnit. That is the fellow, I think. I think. And there's lootable stuff over here, so... How do we... Get... Oh, there's a phylactery. I know what my target's gonna be. Aw, oh, but let's talk to you first. I greet you. <laughs> Drow, after all these years, how did you get here? We made our way through this Mernemblin outpost. Very impressive. What is your destination? We're on our way to the surface. The surface? How interesting. You're almost there, and still the hardest part of your journey lies before you. So who the hell are you? Once, I was known as Suim Hunnit, Archmage of Menzo Berenson. I was the leader of a strong drow force bound for the recapture of these tunnels. We managed to break through the first defense line at the underground river. We even found a way around this rare neblin outpost. Well, I just slaughtered my way through, so fuck you, dude. We thought victory was ours, but we didn't know that our enemies had formed a powerful alliance. Imagine our surprise when we found ourselves surrounded by Spear Neblin, Dwarves, Surface Elves, and even Humans. Why do humans get the even qualifier there? I mean, I guess. They're just really obnoxious. That sounds about right. I do like playing humans. <laughs> Folks say they're boring, and that's true sometimes. But sometimes having a boring character concept, thank you, Emmy, I will as soon as I'm uh, done with this dialogue. Sometimes having a boring character concept like a like being human leads to more fun personalities when you play and other times they end up being boring all right anyway we had no chance i retreated from the battle site and found this area my only chance for survival was to transform myself into an undead creature a lich yep gonna smash your phylactery why did you stay here for all those years i had to initiate the transformation ceremony very hastily something went wrong leaving me trapped in this area for eternity Hmm, I met more survivors of your forces to the south. That cannot be. Everyone was killed ages ago. Hmm, some of your soldiers were able to retreat to a cavern. They'll be dead of old age by now. Unless they were cursed to taste the form of driders and to remain in the cavern until the ways to the surface is reopened for the drow. A fate of all those who fail loth in their punishment... Uh, the fate of all those who fail loth in their plans. Terrible punishment indeed. Well, interestingly, those riders tell a different story about the last battle. What do they say? Well, they say you cowardly fled battle when the tides were turning. They say you are responsible for their failure. <laughs> They're driders, and I'm still a dark elf. Who dares to question the Spider Queen's judgment? Hmm. You know, I feel like killing this guy. He's got loot. I believe them. They want your head, and I'll collect it. All right. Well, hold on a sec. I am not yet in battle, so let's stealth mode, because hide in plain sight is broken, and let's go smash a fucking phylactery. Can I? Bash it down, my friend. Bash it down. Nice. Yep. Mm -hmm. I think he's feeling threatened. Ha 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 How about that? I know, I know lich lore when I see it. Experience points gained 5,000. What's the update to my journal? Oh goodness. The Drider's Revenge. I found Suin. He's transformed himself into some kind of undead creature. I fought and killed him. Now let's hope there's something to loot from the little asshole. No, oh, no longer gonna kill me? No, they still are, and the factions are a little confused again. That's alright. I don't care. Yeah, let's murder them. Oh, I'm apparently trying to pick their pocket. Alright. Well, let's hope this faction bug doesn't screw me over later, as sometimes does happen. Um, but we'll see. Chug, chug, chug. Stabbing his face. 
Really, guys? I just killed your master. You could just, like, shut the fuck up. I may want to watch it, though, just in case this faction bug, uh, shows up later. Oh, I should probably also not die. I feel like that would be wise. Alright, well I'm playing slightly more competently today, I say, before I fuck myself over. I mean, look, I, I can be pr fairly predictable. Alright. Stabbing this guy in the face! Okay. Stabbing this guy in the face. Alright. Crafting stuff. Which I'm not playing a crafter, so I'm not terribly interested in. Ah, can I not loot the mage? Hmm. Hopefully he's got something in his sarcophagus worth something. Really? What the fuck was that? No. Ah, is there no treasure I can get here? Really? Ugh. I am disgusted. I like the sound effect though. Disgusted though. No treasure. No treasure. Ugh. Hmm. Okay, I gotta figure out how to turn that alert off. Okay. Thinking of my next step, because I'm trying to remember what the fuck I did recently. Okay. I might have an issue. Oh, here we go. He does have stuff. I was just clicking from it from the wrong side. Well, let's see. Let's see what deals we have here. I do like being a uh, a rogue with Staff of the Magi. Oh. Well, that's nice. Look at those spells. Zero charges used, so so does that mean mage armor I'll be able to cast for like frickin' ever? And light. Ooh, okay. Well, we're keeping that little asshole. Um, black robe of the Arc Magi. If I had... Oh, actually, that armor class plus five? <laughs> I'm wondering if that's not better than what I've got on right now. I may check that. That would be funny. Like, I wouldn't that be a, a bit... Uh, undignified to uh, be wearing that sort of wearing mage robes but if it's the best I got let's find out let's take the shit under the spelling also nice let's the ring of power what does that fucking do Minsura Lostbone was a powerful pri priest of Malar who enjoyed many a bloody brawl or battle but felt that such fights were simply over too soon Studying the regenerative capabilities of trolls, Minstrel was convinced that more entertainment could be garnered from a field of regenerating warriors than a regular battlefield, so he commissioned the creation of a number of powerful rings. When the rings were finished, he distributed them to particularly vicious warriors, who were often on the opposite sides of battle. Hmm. Alright, so let's take this stuff and let's see how it compares to what the shit I've already got. Also, a skull. I'm totally taking the skull. It fits my goth aesthetic. I mean, I, th I think it's compulsory, really. Hmm. Plus two. The I do like the hide plus five. On the other hand, this is armor bonus plus five. Um, and more spell resistance. So maybe... 27... I forgot what I said before. Let's find out. Hmm. I'll keep it, but I'm going to test how, um, yeah, it is actually better. I'm going to have to keep an eye out for how well my hide works with the, because, I mean, I've got a lot of hide, as you saw, anyway, but I'm going to need to be cautious of that. Ring of Clear Thought, I don't, 
I like having intelligence plus five, but it re really doesn't do anything for me because since I'm not a fucking mage. So let's put the ring of protection in there. Ring of scholars. Yeah, lore plus five is useful. Just we'll keep that just in case. And lesser ring of power. Ooh. Well, we are definitely keeping that little fucker. All right. Trapper's gauntlets. What do they do? Uh, I haven't been setting traps, so let's give myself braces of armor. Now my shit will not stack. Is it rings that conflict with braces? I think it might be. Nope. Is it the necklace that conflicts with the braces? Well, I don't have an alternate necklace that's so worth anything. No. I suppose it doesn't really matter. What's a little redundancy between friends? Okay. Now, before I forget... Ah, I can't fit my bullet title. Can't fit that one either. <sighs> I'm not allowed to name stuff. Well met. All right, Lomer, Pro, and Thranduil. Nah, nothing, nothing new to talk to him about. All right, let's rest. Okay, why are there enemies nearby? Oh, probably more. Oh, those p formerly peaceful skeletons up there I'm probably going to have to murder. Yeah. Is it, actually, does it count as murder if it's a skeleton? I mean, all things considered. Which does remind me I have to edit my, uh, my November nano project. Where there is a romance with a skeleton. Well, you know how it is. Tall, dark, and handsome has many meanings. Sometimes it includes skeletons. Alright. Okay, these are pretty tough, these guys. Okay. Get in skeletons with a sword. kick the very next battle. But that's a problem for future squid. I'm probably best though. Stabbing. Stab. Alright. Alright. More of you fuckers, okay. I guess that's what I get for picking a fight with a lich in a boneyard. friend. You look like you could use a good stabbing! <laughs> and Miller finally killed his adversary. <laughs> Which I probably shouldn't judge because it's been taking me this long. Eh. Alright. Is there more? Are we finally done killing these assholes? It's all skeleton knuckles. I don't want fucking skeleton knuckles. Ah, uh, look at us resting. I'm wearing a dress. 
sorry, a robe. All right, so I think now that I've explored the north, I think I'm ready to move on with the plot in the south. Um, well, let's report into the riders first so they know that I killed their friend, because maybe they will reward me. Riders are fun. None of them, though, is Rip Sania's son, who has escaped one day and wandered off to be a rider somewhere else. I like to think he gets cured, though, and someday will hunt down his mother and try to kill her in revenge. That'd be a sweet family reunion. I'd actually, I've had the thought of playing that character in something, but I haven't quite figured out what I want to do with him. Because I don't think I'd keep him a cleric, even though the Dryder version was. I feel like that just comes hand in hand when you're a servant of Lolth. But... I'm thinking maybe a barbarian. Not as an identification for the character with any barbarian tribe, just mostly the fact that he... Oh, I don't want to be in here. Oh, actually, you know what? These guys, I think the Beholder was fucking useless now as a merchant, but let's see if I can sell him anything. Because I'm kind of wondering if I could just kill him. Do you think I should kill the Beholder? I might not be able to get out there to kill him. You are saved from my treacherous murderdom. Actually, no. I'm gonna go kill him. I'm a draw after all. And I think I'm done with this area. Well, first let's see if he's got anything useful. Hello, handsome. What do you want? Okay, I already did that. Okay, let's see. Nope. Oh, alright, alright, I'll put away the weapon. One sec. I'll put it back in a moment. Good, good, good. Yeah, I'm a drow. I don't like being told what to do. Even if... Gee, can't buy stolen goods. What the fuck is that? What kind of fucking half ass merchant are you? Alright. No, I'm not gonna sell that. Can't help sell that. Green leaf I can sell. I might sell that. There we go. Sell this. Sell these. We'll keep the rings. Rings are not too bad. Okay. Yeah, maybe we'll keep that after all. Okay. So. <laughs> Hello, Pul Pulker Primus. Beauty's in the eyes of the beholder. Actually, that's a disintegration ray. That's a good one. I'm about to murder this guy, though, because I'm a dick. My Hi. steel will strike Oh, I should probably, like, actually put my sword on when I'm gonna backstab a bird in the face. I didn't say I was very smart. <laughs> I uh, hope I actually saved, because I don't think I'm here to survive this. Hi. 
Um, okay. That's not working as well as I was hoping. That's better. Alright. Um, let's exploit hide and plain sight. There we go. Really? Jesus Christ. I can't land a sneak attack on anything, can I? Eh, it was a mean to sneak attack, isn't it? Okay. Hi. Come on. Stab him in the face. Nope, I'm gonna die. Well, that's what I get for turning on my nice friend. Oh god, I didn't save until there? Wait. No, I didn't save until there. Alright. There I go, plotting to backstab a fucking uh, beholder, and I forget to actually save before I do it. Well, that's just rude. I mean, I guess I don't have to backstab the beholder. But I kind of feel like I'm committed to the act now. So, I might still do that. Oh god, I gotta fight my way out. Alright, well... Fuck. <laughs> we'll see. By the time I get back up there, I may change my mind about backstabbing the beholder. I am playing a dick, though. I'd like that to be known. I just don't feel like I'm gonna have need of a... of a... merchant. I wonder... Maybe. Let me think about it. I'll have your life. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to murder the beholder. I, I find his whole I'll he can't be your life. Me annoying. So, assuming I survived to get to him. And then I'm going to sell him stuff. Then I'm gonna kill him. I gotta resell him stuff. The very ha small handful of things I have. Mostly I'm just annoyed because none of the merchants ever let you sell them stolen goods and ha most of, like 90% of the loot is flagged as stolen goods. So I had to leave it all behind. And I resent that. So I wanna stab the beholder just for that. It's not his fault, but again, evil drought. <clears throat> I mean, if you look, see specifically chaotic evil kind of have to. It's like the rule. The rule of chaotic evil means I have to make decisions that suit my wins, even if I know it's a bad idea. For fuck's sake, Nailad, what the hell is wrong with you? I do not want to have to reload this thing just because you won't fucking live. You're gonna die again. Alright, at least that somewhat helped. Fucking hell, Nailad. Really? And granted, I'm not sure why I'm sucking so much, but... There we go. They're skeleton warriors. They're not like fucking dragons. Suck it up and fucking live, you fucker. Alright. Let's close my inventory. I am wearing a dress. Because it is better armor class than what I had. That is super sad. <laughs> All right. All right. I think I think that that's enough of killing McStabs a lot. All right. And we can rest. All right. Now I've got to remember to save my flipping game. Save my game before I try to kill the beholder. <laughs> That song is still in my head, goddammit. Alright. It's not walking. I do kind of miss the light source that I had attached to that one ring, though. <laughs> I forgot how much I suck at this. 
Dark vision is fucking useless. God damn it. I was gonna say something about my character's nipples being hard for justice, but I think they're hard for sadism and betrayal. He's that sort. Now am I stuck behind a thing? Yes, I am. Stop walking into rocks just because your player character, or you are a character and your player is not paying attention to shit. Alright. You should level up minor at some point in Final Fantasy, you know. I need to move on with the fucking plot. That's what I need to do. Or maybe a level up culinary. At least then I'll get tasty food along the way. Tasty food. By the way, as a reminder. As a reminder, the Frog Pond Academy, which would have been tonight, got postponed till tomorrow. So if you want to see a Lorelei Havillard and Stick and Korig and Igor Nakanak, or possibly a flashback, but um, I think I think Effector said the flashback was done, but maybe I'm wrong. So I kind of hope it's the flashback. It seems like fun to play a character that's different from normal. I'm really good at playing an asshole. I used to like that known. Igor is very sweet, but I'm, as you've seen, I'm very good at playing an asshole. Alright, there we go. Finally. Oh shit! I'm an idiot! <laughs> I forgot to go fucking kill the beholder. I just kind of wandered about like a. Like I was zoned out and forgot to go kill that fucker. So I do apologize. I'm going to have to go back up there. Zoned out, ronologging, ranting about. And I forgot to go kill the beholder. At least uh, sell things to him. But also ideally stab him in the back. But I'm going to remember my defensive spells and to be armed this time. <laughs> well, I got to unarm myself actually first. So I can get to him. But then I will kill him. Alright, sorry about that. This is what... This is what I get. <laughs> Just walking past my goal without even thinking about it. Because I'm, um... No more. There we go. Right. All right. Hello, beholder. Let's save. Let's give myself some lovely ghostly visage. Trading post. All right. Now let's sell the shit I don't want to keep carrying for no real reason. Did I keep that bow? I did. Alright. Do I want to get rid of the astral weapon? I mean, probably. All things considered. As much as I like Sonic, I don't think there's really much point. Oh, but he can't afford it anyway. Well, then never fucking mind. God, you're fucking useless, ain't ya? Ain't ya, dude. I'm offended by how useless he is. I really am. Alright. And that I can't sell my fucking drow doom. Nah, those get kept. Just souvenirs. Alright. Nope. Stop it. Stop that! I don't know why it keeps opening on me. I feel, uh, strange. No. Keep the diamonds. Sometimes the diamonds are useful. But, let's get rid of the sapphires. Oh! Small crystals. Can't sell those. I'm 
definitely not selling this asshole thing. Um, that's my badass sword. That sword's the only thing keeping me alive most of the time. Alive. Hmm. You never know if I have to fight Drow. Alright, not you though. Not you. Wait, where's I keeping this? Protection plus three, protection plus three. Let's get rid of one of these. Don't need redundancy. Yeah. That I can sell that. And that. Alright. I've now sold my shit. Now I'm saving. And now, in offense for everything under the sun, I'm going to pull my sword. And I'm going to stab you in the face. We will <laughs> both walk away That's... from this. I mean, I could probably kill their sister, but let's be honest here. I'm not fun to just stab him. Hi. They shall be cleansed. I'll have your life. There I go. I'm confused. Let's see. Can I live through this? Be a fun challenge. I made it once. Your I'll have life. your life. Taste the pain. I'll have your life. Taste the pain. Pain was from my big taste of rainbow. Skittles. Alright, well, let's just kill this bugger. Alright, fine. Oops. Alright, that, that dude's dead. And I'm exploded again. You will Who the fuck that. am I? Come on. Move, you little asshole. Oh, now I'm petrified. <laughs> I might not have planned this out very well. Shall I reload? Eh, who knows? I'm still alive. So how? The nail is doing good. <sighs> I make a cute stone statue, though, don't I? Look at me. I'll stone and shit. Oh, hey, cool. <laughs> I get that. All right. Let's, let's try that again. All right. Now, let's sneak around. Sneak around and stab. Taste the pain. Now, let's sneak around again. Oh, I'm confused. Oh, and also, Alright, hold on. <laughs> that was just me being st that, that was stupid enough that I'm actually going to redo that, because I forgot to put my sword back on. Here's a tip. Backstab works better when you have something to stab with. Oh, I'm sorry. Sneak attack nowadays. Fucking sneak attack. You kids and your sneak attack. In my day, we called it backstab, and we liked it. Huh. Yeah, I know. Let's go. <laughs> Hello, friend. There we go. Taste the did not work. Stopped again. <laughs> That was fun. That guy knows me. This servant's telling me to disarm like I'm some sort of commoner. I am a drow, thank you. Oh, a lot of people I'm trying to kill right now. And the spear neblin are gonna be useless, I'm not gonna be able to loot them. That's gonna be annoying. Well, it's not like he was buying the spear neblin goods anyway, they were all stolen. That annoys me a little bit still, that everything's marked as stolen. Like, of course it's stolen. Ooh. Let's heal some of these. 
don't know what I use them for. Maybe make them into a necklace. <laughs> Alright. More corpses. Let's see. Corpse one. That's very nice, but too heavy for me. And also, I'm not going to be able to sell it, so I'm going to leave it be. Ugh. It goes against my adventure and nature to leave, to leave loot. But there really isn't anything I can do about that. At least I get the potions. anymore. So, let's rest. <sighs> Poor dead beholder. But that's what he gets for not buying stolen goods and being just kind of annoying. He gets stabbed in the face by a drow. I feel like drow wouldn't want to leave someone powerful be behind them too, just in case. Just in case. Alright, so what does it say for the mind player now? He Hex of his dead, his dead is Well, I'd already finished it. I'd already killed his guy, but now I've murdered him too. Ah it's fun. It's fun to murder people. When you're playing a draw anyway. Not in real life. I've never murdered anyone in real life, I just wanna make that perfectly clear. I would like to think I wouldn't have to, but you know, sometimes. Hi. Aw, are you guys mad that I killed your boss? That's so okay. Both walk away from this. God, that character voice is good. Hi. Look at you guys. You're so adorable. Alright, I want to loot your corpse, though. Where is your corpse? Come on. Come on, I gotta loot your corpse. Well, maybe not. Not yet, anyway. There we go. Really? Alright, fine. We're gonna have to kill this guy first. Okay. Come on. Ah, oh, there you go. Let's kill the chieftain. You have made magic, which means I'm gonna hit you with a sword. Oh goodness, 57 points of well, I can I can do 57 points of damage. 45. Look at him, he's very injured. But it's going down quickly enough. Well, let's kill this guy since he's here. Stab. There we go. Much better. He Look at this guy, he's so cute. Gonna kill this all goblins, goblins, goblins. Yes, look at that. All the dead goblins. All the dead goblins. I mean, I think there were a few underlings I probably could have killed, but eh, what's the point? It's not like, I mean, these guys aren't giving me a whole lot of points, just the chieftain. Well, I don't know though. I feel like I should give them a chance to kill me. Let's go, let's go give some people the chance to avenge their overlord. Perhaps they were genuinely loyal and not just mind controlled. Like, look at these guys. They're genuinely upset that I killed their boss. Hello. Look, yeah, they're so cute. Goblins are some of my favorite creatures. Okay. Oh, well, let's get over here. Go in here. Hello, I can hear a fellow. In oh, and where's where's others? Oh, there, there we go. Aw, so loyal, so dead. They, that's what you get for being annoying. I know, it's not your fault. It truly isn't, but... Ah, oh, darlings, it's just... It's just the way it goes. Sometimes your boss is annoying, and then you try to avenge him, and then I have to murder you. Yeah, <sighs> being evil is so tiring sometimes. It really is. Oh, look! Dr 
driders. Not the same driders <sighs> I was friends with before, but more driders to murder. That's nice. Maybe I can even get some more XP. Oh, I'm not too far from leveling, actually. Mm. I don't think I'm going to get it from these guys, though. 57 at a pop is not terribly impressive. Ah, so <sighs> I don't murder for the XP. I murder for the principal. What principal, you may ask? Uh, I don't know. I'll think of one later. Chaotic evil. The principal of chaotic evil. I only have two evil characters in my uh, in my Neverwinter Nights stable right now, but I like to, I'd like to think I've made them both sufficiently evil in different ways. Vipsania was kind of a calculating evil. Also, she had a baby. I think Vezarin's just kind of like you know stab. <laughs> Though he did wait a while to kill the the beholder, and that's pretty uh pretty impressive, maybe. I don't know. What do the kids find impressive nowadays with their jazz and their uh cool beats? I have no idea what I'm saying. It is possible that I'm still jet lagged. Europe is beautiful, by the way. France is definitely It's kind of weird that m the French bathrooms I saw most of them had the sink outside of the toilet area which I guess makes a certain amount of sense but like um always made me weirded out to touch the light switch afterwards cuz you know you want to be clean and uh not get Grossness on your light switching your doorknob. Wash your hands first. I don't know. <laughs> but it was lovely. That, that is my international observation. I always try to find one that, that no one's heard about. <laughs> At least as far as I know. Alright, let's see. Let's see. I think this way is the Dryder Cave. It does say Dryder's Lair. Lair cave, what's the difference? <laughs> Hello. Where's your fearless leader? There you are, the nameless leader. You return. Do you bring me good news? Serum has found his end. At least we have our revenge. I give him the skull. So let's talk about my reward. What do you want? Huh, do I want to know how to get to the surface? Do I want gold or magic trinkets? Gold's been pretty useless so far, so let's ask for magic trinkets. We have only a few magic items, and most of them are of minor power. Well, show me. I have a magic scimitar. Nice weapon. A cloak. Protect you from missiles. Hmm. Well, I've got a cool weapon. So I'm gonna go with the cloak. And 5,000 HP. Let's see what this cloak actually does. Because my own current cloak is kind of crappy. Oh, it is high enough that I don't know what it does. And I have no way to fucking uh, figure it out, do I? Cloak of shielding. Oh, you know what? This, this looks good. This Pewafui is clearly recognizable as the sign of a drowned noble. It obviously belongs to House Oblodra, but its sister is unknown. Maybe bad, dangerous to wear this cloak in the presence of other nobles from Menzo Berenson. You know what? I'm going to risk it. Alright. Eh, you're not very grateful, are you? Alright, anyway. Ooh. Let's give myself a 19 dexterity, friends. 19. Sadly, my uh, weapons finesse is a wasted uh, feat, but that's okay. That's alright. Hmm. Alright. Poison save. Nice. Uh, let's see. Hmm. 
could do stealthy. Lightning reflexes. No, you know what I want to do? Even though I don't really have the strength to make use of it. I kind of want to knock folks down. Hmm, that might be a bad idea. Let's use disarm. What's dirty fighting? Hmm. Yeah, we'll go with disarm. Someone told me disarm was pretty cool, so I'm gonna try it. Alright. So, now there's only one part of this area that I haven't really explored yet, and that is to the south. So let's go to the south. I think it'll be fun. Alright. Ungrateful spider fuckers. Alright. I can do anything about this. I remember reading somewhere that gust of wind actually can help with this sort of thing. I'm wondering if it can. Because uh, I feel like I have something with gust of wind. Because I murdered somebody for it. Wand of lightning. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I don't. Wand of summoning. I thought I had something. Oh, wand of the winds. Let's see. That does look like gust of wind. Alright. So you know what? Let's give this a try. I want to know if it actually works, because I read somewhere that you could do it. Like, whenever you get it like a stinking cloud, you can use Gust of Wind to get rid of it. So let's see if that actually works. Again, something happened. Maybe it didn't. Alright, I'm gonna reload. I'm not gonna waste the fucking thing. Getting through there is gonna be a pain, I think. and try it again. Alright. I wonder where I aim the fucking thing. Maybe I'm mis-aiming. Not here. Oh, that that definitely seemed to do something. Okay. Mm, so I'm not here. Just to that part. Definitely a wall opening here. That's where I got the fucking thing before. Okay. So. Well, this definitely seems to go on. Alright. Now what? Aside from waste, uh, waste some wind. Which I'm not gonna do. I'm gonna reload. Fuck you. I'm keeping my wind. I'm full of hot air, damn it, and I know how to use it. Alright. So. 
and let's go talk to the annoying boss. Hello, drow people who are useless. Because I'm the only one who ever does anything in this fucking thing. Hi, boss. Well, hello. Well, you're back. Are you prepared for your next mission? Yes. I was pleased with your performance with the gas, but I still prefer to keep the main body of our troops back until the way is scouted well. We will go ahead and secure the way. We will follow you when everything is cleared. Are you ready? I'm prepared as I ever be. Then go. Give us a sign. Oh, hey. Neat. Okay. I wasn't expecting to be teleported there, but that's kind of cool. Okay. Convenient. Alright, now is there- oh, okay, there is a way out, and also there are things I have to kill. Hi! Die, unworthy foe! Thank you. This level will be a while. too high level for those uh, potions to be all that useful anymore. Which is flattering, but also a little annoying. There we go, that's good. Honestly, oh, fucking damn it. Just kill things. Oh, that weak, supposedly. Oh, you might be. Alright, let's see. I know I put some shit in one of the bags. Okay. Oh fuck, that's not working very well, is it? There we go, that's better. Um, let's go kill this thing. Okay, now that I'm not in combat. Haha. <laughs> Exploiting a terribly overpowered skill. I seem to be unable to hit it. And Nilad's kind of having an issue. Seriously? Okay. This way we'll rest. Well, there are enemies nearby. My ass. Come on. Do, 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 do. Come on. I should be getting farther and farther away from the enemies enough to rest to rest. Maybe not. No, I can't rest. I'm doomed. Doomed. There we go. I know I get far enough. <laughs> I know how this shit works. Okay. Hmm. I'm not really happy about the stat decrease, though. Probably should have jolted an antidote while the... Oh, no. We're fine. Alright. 
Look at all these dead. Look at all this dead shits. I don't see anything to really loot though, aside from Etterclap. Etterkappa shit. It's not like a merchant's gonna buy that. Oh, it's a phase spider. Hi. I feel like I should be more uncomfortable killing spiders considering who the goddess of my city is. I mean, technically, I, I am a Varen follower and not a Vault follower, but still. I'd also prefer she not know that, because, uh, gods get unhappy. should try to save what's his face here have some have some drugs what's his face die unworthy foe I may your enthusiasm dude ah I'm tired of my unworthy foe Okay, let's disengage. Now yeah. oh, let's have something. Okay. Look at all these charms. Seriously, more? Well, I can't go with you, dude. I'm kind of too busy. Okay, a flush bar. Probably means I should be looking at this more. Oh, there's Queen Spider. Fantastic. Let's go kill her. Die, unworthy foe! Uh, well, um, Millet's not gonna kill her, clearly. Hold on. Millet, can you try not to die until I get there? Because that would be lovely. Emma Moss is being annoying. Stop that. Live for a sec, dude. Why are you called sh shotting on a on a spider anyway? I don't understand. I guess I should give him one more. Don't really want to waste my potions on this asshole, but there we go. Holy shit, this guy's hard. Well, lady. Poor spiders just hanging out in their home, only to be murdered by me. On the other hand, the HP is good, so, well, what can you do? What can you do? Nothing here worth doing. So let's see, what is in those caves to the south? The south we go. Let's see how many ways I can kill myself. I'm gonna guess offhand 30. 
that is my nice round number guess, and I should actually go in the right direction. <sighs> Ooh. Interesting. Can I burn it, or can, do I have to bash it? <laughs> hmm. There we go. We won't both walk away from this. Okay, that's not helpful. Just run them. My deep. steel Stop it. will strike true. Ah, this asshole. Why are you doing this to me? All right, this is irritating. Try this one. There we go. through now. I'm an idiot. <sighs> okay, so. Spiders! Alright. Done with the spiders, technically, but. get there. Something is terribly wrong here. We won't go any further. Murmuring, murmuring. I found a cutscene. You can't simply turn us all away. This is mutiny. We demand to know who killed all the spiders behind us. This is a bad omen. Uh, technically I did. I'm the leader and you're my minions. You cannot demand anything from me. We are from far from Meso Berenson. Hmm, that's true. It's funny. Alright, what did you do to those spiders? Let's lie. They were already dead when they entered the cave. You're a liar. Their wounds were still beating. This is your last chance. Why did you kill the spiders? I cleared the path for you. They're children of Loth. How could you dare to attack them? I had to defend myself. You were attacked? Yes. The spiders attacked me on sight. They are children of Loth. Why should they attack their sp her faithful? Maybe our goddess has turned her favor from us, meaning you. Watch your words, scum. It's obvious that you have terribly failed. Your murder of the children of Loth will probably be the doom of us all. There's only one way of redemption. You will undertake a deicide, of course. Fucker. What's a deicide? You'll go alone and find the way to the surface. If you survive and succeed, you are innocent. <laughs> You've been, you know what? I'm going to be sarcastic this time. You've been sending me on missions like this since I joined your forces. I've got nothing to lose right now. This conversation is now over. Return when your task is done. I mean, it's true, though. So, bug beers, block tunnels, and block tunnels. So, is there a the bug bear is the only way I can go? Or how blocked are we talking about? It is funny though. She is clearly just using this as an excuse. That said, I probably should have been better ab about not killing them. Commander Detzlar. What do you want, Nilad? They want my head. Why don't you leave me alone? It would be easy to abandon you. But nevertheless, I'm wondering if you could use a little help. You want to help me. So it is. I am still your lieutenant. Why? What's the best for you and me? 
What do you want? You're a fast planner. Give me a magical item. Oh, neat. Okay, one sec. Hmm. Actually, I wonder if I shouldn't have gone into a different direction first. I'm gonna actually reload. And maybe pick a different dialogue. Sorry. I'm just thinking out loud. Thinking out loud. Hmm. Okay. So, let's see. Where am I? Oh, I'm pointing up. Alright, let's go south. That is pretty cool, though. I like I like that setup. So, it was a trap. I am now being blackmailed into doing what I was going to do anyway. So. Alright. They're all freaked out by the death of the spiders. But, you know, the spiders can go fuck themselves. I, f I do like that. I, I think I my character did betray himself as a Varen follower by killing the spiders. I didn't hesitate, even. That's good role-playing. It was an accidental role-playing, but we're going to go with it. We're going to claim it's role-playing. Alright, we, we went through this. Everyone's hysterical. Yada, yada, yada. And maybe I should have gone that way. I don't know. I actually wanted to see if I could talk to a few, mo few of these people first, though. I won't let you get away with this. Let me have words with one as possible. Alright, yes, yes, yes. I lied first. No, nope, protect. I cleared the path for you. And it's finally explaining. Attack me on sight. Maybe I got his rune. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna stick with the insulting stuff. Alright. Alright, decide. Let the goddess decide. Alright, so we got Lomer. We got a draw militia guy. Well met. I know you're innocent, but the spider incident is alarming. Oh, that's sweet that they think I'm innocent. I'm actually not innocent, but you know what? We're gonna well just go met. with it. Well met. Cornell? Well met. You had your heroics in the past, but, those death of the, but the death of those spiders is a terrible thing. I don't know what happened there, but you should set things right quickly. Oh, well, you can go fuck yourself. Lomir? Well met. I know. This time you're not to blame. She'll get us all killed with her incompetence. You must succeed. Take a closer look to the corridors to the north. Okay, so that's the one I was going into before, where I met Nilad. Um, hey, that was cool, though. What's his name who I hate is actually someone on my side for once. That's bizarre. Oh, this guy wants well to talk to met. me. There's a large layer of creatures to the west. There were armor and weapons. Some kind of hobgoblins. They look dangerous. Alright. Oh, what's to the north? Yeah, maybe I, I will go get that... Get fucker Neil out again. Alright. Another crossroads. Let's hope this is the right way to go. Here he is. Alright. Commander Depslar. What do you want? They want my head. Why don't you leave me alone? It'd be easy to abandon you, but nevertheless, I'm wondering if you could use a little help. You want to help me? I'm still your lieutenant. Why? Be sure it's the best for you and me. So what do you want? You're a fast learner. Give me a powerful magical item. Alright. You know, let's give him the weakest shit I have. How about this ring of protection plus two? Eh, I thought about something more valuable, but it's useful to me. I'll accept. Alright, so take it. But I warn you, this is your share of everything we find in the tunnels. <laughs> I gave him the cheap shit. Ha, ah, an illuminated node. Alright, let's see what's up here. Alright. Alright, there's a pathway that way. Is there a pathway anywhere else? Let's see what we're looking at.
another cavern. Alright. Maybe I'll go this way first since there's multiple ways out. Oh, the Mad Mage. Strange node and a dwarven maze. Shit, do I really want to go this way? I like to be thorough. I do, I do. Hmm. Well, this seems like the sort of place I don't want to be in yet, because there's a dwarven maze. This looks like plot. So let's try other directions. First. Now this... I'm not getting in there, I see. Okay. So what's this way? Is this the other entrance? I mean, it should. Things if lined up. Yep, it is. Okay, well that makes me happy. That makes me happy. I mean, I could go explore the bugbears, but I want to see what's over here first. I'm assuming they're bugbears on account of it being called the bugbear area. Thank you, helpful map. Uh-oh, what the fuck's this? I got a cutscene, shit. I went the wrong way. I have footsteps. Let's take cover and stay silent. Or not. <laughs> we have company. Oh, hey. I don't see anything. People. Do I get to murder them? Or are they going to be friends? Stay like silent. They're all around us. Ashmar, bring the torch that we may lighten this darkness a little. Uh. Are they surface dwellers? Give me a torch. I already told you to advance the stealth, but no. We cannot see in the darkness like you know. What are they supposed to talking about? Best go ahead and see what comes. Oh yeah, Lolf said I could, uh, understand languages. Ah, oh, I hate those mindless humans. Commander, can you understand them? We haven't found some proper loot for more than a week. Let's go and find some. You always think with your purse, Cedric. Who are you to criticize, Mr. I Collect Magica? <laughs> they sound like a, my parties. Not again. Do you think it's wise to discuss this here and now? <laughs> Ashmar's right. Someone should go ahead and examine this top cavern. Someone's got to be the sane person. How about the gnome? We could draw him on a rope and, or put him on a rope and draw him back. <laughs> Oh, okay. Great joke, Cedric. I don't know. I think it's a lot of fun. Let's go. If anyone dares to attack, we'll slay him with our sheer numbers. Uh, six really isn't an overwhelming number, Dress. <laughs> if anything is alarmed by this cavern... If anything is in this cavern, it is already alarmed by our light. It'd be suicide to go in this scouting. What do we do now? <laughs> <laughs> They're idiots. I bet there's nothing at all. Okay, now I want to. I want to see where this is going. Little Nettle is always afraid of his mighty drow, but all he's found yet is dust and stone. Hey, these people seem like they came from the surface. Be quiet, apprentice. Cease this insulting tone.
with everything as he's been then for years. Hopefully it is, but the drow are masters of deception. I've had enough of this talking. I'll go ahead now. Wait. And here we are, waiting. Ah, oh, for heaven's sake. Why is it always like this? Ish. Commander, what do we do? Uh, I guess we're gonna go talk to them. This could be entertaining. Hey, maybe I can convince them I'm a jurist. Hello. Hey, help me with us. They found us. Drow. There's no need to panic, little friend. Okay, I'm gonna try to bluff this out. This will be fun. Why are you talking to us? Our, your behavior is not drow-like. How can you judge drow-like behavior? Obviously, you've never seen a drow before. These all look like surface dwellers. No description, though. That's true, but your reputation. Okay, how much of a dick am I going to be here? Let's do this. Our reputation is a product of prejudice or fantasy. There may be evil drow, but most of us are peace-loving and good. Oh, that's bullshit. Okay. Let me ask you a question, Darkness Dweller. We're adventurers, uh, always searching for treasure. Do you know where to get some? Oh, I see. Oh, God. Don't get me wrong. We're the good ones. Maybe there's an evil tribe of orcs somewhere around. Uh. Okay, I want to see what, uh, what my character's thinking of. Let me think it over. Ah, oh, yes, there's something. What is it? There's a layer of evil monsters to the south. They've been threatening this area for a long time long time. Can you tell me about anything about their lair? They've piled up the loot of many caravan. I haven't been there, but I think they don't expect a direct attack. The Hobgoblin army. <laughs> How wonderful. We put this threat to an end. Let's move south. What lovely people. Alright. Alright. I don't even remember which direction I came from. Alright, well. <laughs> that is fun. Okay. Where am I going? I think I'm. Oh, I hate fucking chase cam. Can I switch back? What's down this way? Oh, it's the bugbear lair. It's a circle. Okay. Uh, do we have. Should we take part? I'm not sure we need to. shall be cleansed. away from this I had the adventurers kill them that's fun that is fun look at that and all the stuff to leave back to the drought camp oh my I'm enjoying this I am not enjoying this fucking camera <laughs> can you stop fucking spinning around oh god I hate the camera alright can I switch back Shit. Change key settings? No. Okay, hold up, maybe. Alright. Toggle camera mode. Zoom. There we go. That's better. I can put myself in fucking. Okay. Are you gonna. Did you freeze on me? No! Fuck! <laughs> After all that, the fucking thing is. And here's my... It's usually the inventory bug, but there we go. Okay. Well, now I know what to do. So that's good. <laughs> ah, how irritating. Okay. Alright, let's try this bullshit again. 
Let's try this bullshit again. All right. Come on, come on. Are you not working? Hmm. That could be a problem. That could be a problem. I sincerely say. say. Okay. Well, we are back. Back into the game. And I just manipulated some uh, some uh, warriors into killing some bugbears for me. I am very intrigued to see where this is going. I'm not really intrigued in seeing that entire cutscene again, though. Okay, I can talk to them. Alright. Let's talk to them. I like the faces. Alright. So, I'm lying my ass off. Okay, there is something. Evil monsters, pile of loot. There you go. <laughs> 6,000 gold experience. Nice. Ah, alright, that was fun. That is fun. Okay, so they're going south. That'll give me a chance to look around up here a little more, and then I can join in the fight. I'm wondering what's around that side. Before we go south to help the, them kill the bugbears that are in our way. I mean, I suppose I could have talked to the bugbears first, but uh, I didn't feel like it. Mm, Alright, I don't see an area transition, so I guess south is the way to go. Oh, oh, the poor monk is dead. Your taste shall be cleansed. Poor, poor monk. <laughs> Would it be bad form to kill them after the fight? I like to play the ship while they're, while they're busy. It's fun. Alright, can I loot the- oh, can I loot the monk? Let's go for it. Can I? Come on, come on. Come on. Here, kitty kitty. Hmm. Can I get over here? Yes, let's go this way. You won't let me loot my friend. A brand new friend, friends. Okay. I made her have mercy with their misleaded souls. Ah, uh, well, someone had to. Neddy? Nettlebin? What a battle. We found a good number of magical items. Cedric the Greedy. Okay, so. Do you think I could kill them? I'm gonna try. You Die! Will I'll have your life! Oh, there we go. I should probably have killed them. The wizard first time. Yeah, let's kill this guy. Hi. Damn it, I wanted to kill him. I 
also should remember to put on my defense and stuff. Oh, this is fun. Look at that. Look at these people I have murdered. How many magic missile spells does this guy have? Jesus. See, if they didn't say they found the magic items, I possibly would have been able to let them live. So let's see what we have. There's a whole shit ton of stuff here. Alright. So many dead things. So let's start up here. Let's see what we got. So I already looked in there. Oh, someone's still alive. Oh, that guy. Sorry, dude. I mean, I didn't even realize you were still here. Stop potioning yourself. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's W again. Damn it, why can't I fucking hit him? Is that an 18? There we go, finally. Alright. Well, let's loot his corpse. Oh my. Ah, oh, hell. There's so many things I want to take. Okay. I'm gonna have to be judicious. Let's level up. Well, let's level up Assassin. Same deal as usual. Right. Oh, did I just get invisibility? Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Assassin abilities. Invisibility. Okay, that's awesome. Alright. So, let's see. There's a weapons rack over there. I think I'm going to want to... Just for cleanliness sake, I want to put things that I'm not going to keep in the weapon rack. Alright, so let's see what we have. We have... Hmm. Where's my ring of scholars? Do I have it back on? Probably. Hmm. Alright, this could be interesting. So let's take that. I have to lighten this load. I know. Relax, relax. Things that we need to figure out what they are. Rings are good to sell and usually are sellable, so. Okay. Okay. Well, there's a monk over here. I'm not sure if I can get the corpse of it. Well trying met. To. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Okay. I should read through that later. Um. Alright. But first, let's, let's loot shit. Okay. Can I get to this corpse? I think it all depends. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. So that's the first batch of stuff. And then 
unfortunately, I can't carry too much, but I can carry some. So here's some rec weapons rack. Let's see what I do and do not want. Mm, constitution plus two is pretty good. Cloak of protection plus one. I would like to be able to sell that if I can. Except I did murder the merchant, but maybe there'll be, maybe be one in the future. Boots of speed. Oh, those I'm keeping. Holy shit, yes, I'm keeping boots of speed. Number plus two. Intelligence plus two. Oh. Alright. I don't need that. I know that. Um, I just can't fucking figure it out. Oh, it's another green leaf. Well, I did enjoy... S oh, that actually looks better than the one I had before. So, maybe I will keep that. Ah, here's the problem. I just want to keep everything. That's, that's not good. That isn't good. Yep. More that I want to keep things to sell, but... I might not be able to do that. Hmm, okay. This actually has some potential. I know that those are weak. More wands. Of course I'm going to keep the wands. I feel like I have to. Gonna have to think about this some. My greed. It gets me every single time. So the bugbear chieftain, did he have any items? I'm not seeing a lot of items here. Come on. Oh, let's unpause. Looting and inventory management, always tough. Let's see, there should be some dead folks that I helped murder over here. Oh, Neblin was is definitely a mage. Ooh, nice. Well, let's just get everything and we'll sort it out later. Guess I'm gonna have to be judicious then. All right, all right. Are we doing this? Okay. Do I want the cloak of protection plus two? I don't know that I really do. one of these in case I have to bribe my henchmen again. Mm. I 
that's actually pretty cool. I do want to keep these. A shift in tactics. That one's definitely going in there. What about the small shield? We'll come back to this in a, in a bit. Okay. The lucky one. And it's not terrible. to lighten this load. Okay. Well, that is true. That is true. Um, I'm not going to have any use for a comma. Keep that. Keeping a stat boost is not a bad thing. Alright, let's go steal from the next one. Sorry guys, I'm kind of staring at things and not talking because I'm trying to figure shit out. But that's not very entertaining, so I'll try to talk more. So I'm not s creepily silent. Basically, I just want to make sure I can loot everything I need to loot. Eh, who needs that? City of Neverwinter, my ass. Okay, so I, I did get him. I know that. But he's, his corpse is still there, so did I leave something on his corpse? It's possible. Oh, there's a page two. I did leave some. Oh, a cloak of protection plus three. That's different than the other two. Okay. Gonna have to look into this a little more. Alright. That should be enough now. To get rid of him. Alright. I will do those. Do these. So let's... Let's loot these guys. Other remains. All right. <sighs> I have to yeah, lighten I this load. I know, dear. I know. <sighs> I have to lighten this load. Okay. I'll look at these more in depth in a bit. But first... Ooh, that was, that's cool. Let's go find the barrels and we'll come back for stuff. Shove everything in the barrels. If I find another uh, merchant that... Well, it's not like I can go back to the beholder, so I don't feel bad about it. But if I find another merchant, I can always maybe come back here for stuff. Because unfortunately, I can't really... S okay, tower shield plus one. I guess that's going to stay here. Longsword plus three is going to stay... I still enjoy the amusement factor of having that thing. Uh, plus two is weaker than me. Oh, fire burns kind of nice. I might keep that in case I need a fiery weapon. Kind of like I want to keep that too. Alright. And don't need that. 
that. that. And there we go, I'm being silent again. Ugh, that's not right. That's not healthy. Silence is definitely not healthy. Okay. Okay. Eh, boring. Probably get a good sum <sighs> for it, but this, this character load. doesn't... I don't think he cares that much about money. Ah. Uh, I think. Alright, is there anything here I forgot? The horse cell helmet, definitely. The braces of dexterity, though. Ooh, keys. Alright, acid resistance. That, that might be useful to have. I'm saying as though that's gonna make a difference right there. Alright. Now let's see. Is there anything I'd rather leave behind? Not really. Got those. That's reasonable. That makes sense. Okay. Well, maybe I'll take those out and put these back. Alright. And then see if we can put somewhere somewhere else. Okay. I might keep that just in case I need fire. Okay. Alright, let's see. Back to the other dead person. He was fun. I enjoyed killing him very much. <laughs> Alright, I think it was down here. Alright, that guy's got remains. Still. Another, another of these I have I to lighten this of. load. if these doors will open because I do have a key let's see, let's see oh, okay, there's a chest I'm very curious about this chest let's go look is it a normal chest? is it abnormal? Hmm. oh, what is this stuff? Come on, open. Thank you. Oh, a bag of holding. Yay! Another bag of holding. That makes me happy. I can take a look at that later. Okay. Yeah, what does this thing do? So I'll have to figure out what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to get rid of. Such fun. Okay. I have to lighten this load. Oh shit, I need that potion. Need all the potions. Give me my drugs, man. Alright, my drugs. Okay, I think that's everything off the corpses. With the adventurers. Anything I want to take with me? I don't know, they're kind of all bland. I mean, 
mean, I think you get some good stories out of it, but nah. Let's get the comma in here, because there's not much I can do with a comma. Okay. Rogue links. Oh. Well, I think I might be wearing that instead. <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know. Hide move silently. The bonuses are nice, but... Oh! Uh oh. Did I just lose the thing? I think I did. Alright. There you go. Alright. Okay. That's fair. So let's see what we got. Let's see what this is. Oh, Doran's mistake. Oh, that's interesting. Doran was a master dwarven smith, but even masters make mistakes. Well, this is something a suit of worthless elven chain, for researchers, of course. He accidentally dropped several links into the forge, and that trace amount of mithril tainted everything he made until he could scour the thing from top to bottom. Each suit was made during this time was infused with a strange magic. But Doran threw them all on the trash heap and was known to slap anyone he saw wearing one. I love that. That's that's a great backstory. Alright, so I wanna keep that for a while anyway. I have to lighten this load. I don't know if I'll be able to keep it full up, but I'd like to keep that for a while. Okay, let's see. What could be that heavy? Do I have a stray armor thing somewhere? Okay. That's a pretty good treasure, I have to say. Um, I don't know if that I need a cloak of protection plus two. I feel like that's not what I need. Okay, let's put both of these in here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. I should probably consolidate these because I feel like we have less stray potions places. Now what the hell is so heavy? Okay, that's gonna go in there. <sighs> what the hell am I carrying that's so, so fucking heavy? Because I'll just put it in the bag of holding, I'm happy to do that. Well, not that bag of holding, clearly, but... Okay. Okay. Come on, stop moving around. Oh, I'm paused, that's why. Alright, back to this. Fuck, fuck. What can I do to... to get rid of some dead weight? The problem is, as I've said before, I'm just carrying too much stuff that's not... I don't know. I don't know what could be 12 pounds. <laughs> What is 12 pounds? Tell me, tell me. No, I'm never gonna know. I'm gonna be dragging this ship forever. All right, let's one more sleep. Okay. No. I'm not sure where... You know, I'm going to deal with that at a later date. <laughs> I will figure that stuff out later. I think it's probably the armor I'm wearing. Anyway. Okay. Don't want that. I think I'm going to move on. 
now that we've stolen the stuff from the bugbears and most of it does seem kind of admittedly quite cool. Okay, money. Let's move on. I'm not walking too annoyingly right now, thanks to the boot boots of haste, so I'm gonna just keep going. So, that part was very entertaining. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. Alright, honestly, with the my moments of silence and things like that, I think, I think I'm still a little jet-lagged. And unfortunately, I think that means uh, it's uh, affecting the quality of my output right now because I'm kind of zoning out more than I should and not speaking out loud. So I'm thinking after a little bit more, maybe um, maybe I'm going to explore the next room. I think after that I might call it quits because, yep, I'm feeling it tonight. I didn't feel the jet lag too much while I was there, but I'm definitely feeling something now that I'm back. Maybe we will go this way. And there's a fellow here. Let's talk to this guy. And I'm feeling like after talking to this guy would be a good place to call it a night. Finally, this mercy has an end. Who are you and what are you talking about? I'm Tarnus Tane, once known as Tarnus the Green. You're a human. How could you ever notice that? What do you- well, actually, it's probably more sarcastic. How could you ever notice that? What are you doing here? This cavern is my home for centuries now. Your home? I thought humans are surface dwellers. I haven't seen the sun for many, many years, but this is a long story. Tell me. Centuries ago, during the last raids of your race against a surface, dwarves, Reneblin, high elves, and humans formed an alliance. We heard this part of the story before. I was part of the forces who finally defeated the drow in this area, making them pay for their unspeakable crimes. Not a single one of your despicable brethren ever made it back to your lair. Well, I could be angry, but this is all ancestor stuff, so whatever. If they were weak enough to get killed by this douche, they deserved it. But why are you still here? The Alliance decided to fortify this area when the fighting was done. No drow should ever be able to come set foot at the surface again, including you. So the Spirneblin built a large outpost to protect the lower corridors, and the dwarves constructed and the dwarves constructed a large maze around the surf. Uh, and the dwarves <laughs> constructed a large maze around the exit to the surface. Oh boy, yeah, definitely, I'm gonna <laughs> call it the night. I think after this, tell me more about the Spirneblin outpost. Let's start there. The outpost was intended to be the first defense line against the drow, attacks from below. But as the gnomes found mithril ore in the area, they expanded it into a fortified mine. As far as I know, they're still mining there. Actually, they are not. Tell me more about the dwarven maze. The dwarves built a large maze. It took many years to complete all the traps and magical devices and guardians. Ah, I think that's in the next room, and I definitely don't feel like I have the energy for that tonight. They were... They returned to their kingdoms when it was done. Is the maze still functional? All installations and minions are designed for eternity. Everything is still in order and working fine. But where's the part of the High Elves? There are guardians of the magic wards on the surface and returned there. I never saw one again. What was your part? My part was that of the fool. What do you mean? I took responsibility blah, I took responsibility for the maintenance of the magical installations. My life force is bound to this maze and so much Ah, and so is my body to the cavern. For the record, my tiredness is, is, is not to a criticism of this game. This game is fun. The yawning, trailing off, not a reflection of the game's quality. It's just a reflection of the fact that I'm still a little jet locked. Alright. So you cannot leave this place, and your job is to keep the magic functional. Okay, tell me more of these magical installations. Interesting question. You're the enemy. I was expecting for so long. Why should I give you information at all? You can trust me. Don't consider me a fool. I'm neither a fool nor mad. 
but your success is my success in this case. I want to leave this place, and so you must succeed. Ask me and I will answer. How do I enter the Dwarven Maze? Go to the sundial to the east and say the word of passage, Melon. This is an elven dialect. It means as much as friend in your language. Ah, Tolkien. What will I find? You'll find a large number of powerful constructs and traps. Prepare yourself well. There's no way to bypass them. Are there any passwords needed? Only the entrance doors, protected by a word of passage. But there are magical teleporters and traps. Oof. Tell me about them. They're intended to confuse you. Just go and check them out yourself. I'm here if you need more help. I'll go. Okay, I think I will do that, but not tonight. <laughs> that sounds like it's going to require more more brain power than I actually have. So, okay. <laughs> All right. Let me see who I want to raid out to, such as it is. And hope I don't botch the uh, controls to do so. Alright, exit. And raiding out. Raiding out. Who to? Who to? Who would be fun to raid out to? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Ah. Oh, Effector is doing. Um, Effective Change is doing Final Fantasy XIV online. I don't really want to spoil myself, but I think it might be good to... We can do a raid drop and run. <laughs> At least I'm going to do a raid and run. Okay. So I think that is going to be my plan. Now, as a reminder, if anyone is a fan of watching pe people play D&D online, tomorrow we will be meeting and playing Frog Pond Academy. I play the gnome, Igor Nakanak. Alright, so let's see what we can do here. You guys have a wonderful night.